Hello everybody, welcome back to Serene Queen TV. I'm your host T. Um, today's video is gonna be me discussing Beyonce's projects, okay? We're gonna get into her discography, but before I dive in, please um, go to the description, check out the website, follow me on socials, like, share, subscribe, and then, you know, at any point, let's talk in the comments because halfway through i might piss you off i might piss you off in the beginning i might do it at the end or i might not piss you off at all you might love this whole video and you might agree with my opinion through and through so let's just get right into it let's talk about her debut album dangerously in love i thought it was a great project overall it's a project that i still listen to i think the music on dangerously in love is still very timeless it's a more timeless body of work than I Am Sasha Fierce, in my opinion. Um, let me go through Dangerously in Love and tell y'all projects that I particularly enjoy. So, our songs that I enjoy. Of course, Crazy in Love, we love it, but for me, it's a little too mainstreamy. I'm not really a big fan of songs like that typically blew up on the radio i don't know so crazy loves a hit but i don't know i've heard it so many times i'm kind of tired of it kind of like hotline bling i've just i've heard it too much that i'm sick of it um but i really enjoyed hip-hop star again a song that is lesser known be with you amazing song me myself and i fucking classic hit for all women the song yes was good um Speechless is a nice, like, slow, you know, sensual jam. Um, it's kind of giving Beyonce in her Luther Vandross bag. And then she does get actual Luther Vandross on this album with The Closer I Get To You. But I really don't know that song like that. Um, I really didn't like That's How You Like It with Jay-Z. It was kind of whack. Um... I didn't like daddy neither. That was kind of weird. I was like, that's a little bit weird. Um, it went, and it's, you know how it went from daddy to daddy lessons, chow. You know, Matthew, what the fuck? So, you know, baby boy was all right. Signs, oh, I like signs with Missy. Signs was cool. I like Beyonce kind of talking about astrology. I was like, that's cool. So, um, I think it was a, there are some good songs on the album. Do I like every single one? No, but um, overall, I think it's a good project. I think it's a great debut for an R&B artist, but something that I didn't know that I know now is that it's full of samples. And I don't really wanna try to like say that, oh, because it's full of samples, it's, I mean, it's full of samples, but it's still a good album, okay? Like, I'm not gonna say that. The vocals are pretty good. Uh, I think, of course, I think we all know Beyonce is like way stronger vocally um, now, but her vocals still did what they needed to do.